Hello, I'm Dr. David Cathcart. I'm a family practice physician from Heartland Regional Medical Center in St. Joseph, and we're going to talk about uh, chemotherapy drugs and their side effects today. If you've been listening to this series on chemotherapy, by now you certainly know how chemotherapy kills cancer cells, and unfortunately, in the process, it kills many healthy cells. Consequently, that can lead to some, uh, lead to some permanent lasting effects of chemotherapy that are evident physically. One of those, for example, is uh, loss of, of uh, height, loss, lack of growth, uh, because chemotherapeutic agents can affect the uh, growth plates in bones. Uh, they may close prematurely and result in uh, an individual uh, not reaching their full height potential, particularly if they've been taking those uh, chemotherapeutic agents as a child. They can also affect worse hair loss. Now, the good news for chemotherapy is, is that that hair loss is uh, generally reversible and will come back fully. Now, that's not necessarily true for other types of, of cancer treatment. For example, radiation, the hair growth may not come back. Um, another physical effect with chemotherapy is uh, damage to hearing. So there are multiple potential physical effects. Probably the most obvious one is that of short stature or lack of full growth potential, particularly if you have to take those medications before your growth plates close. This is Dr. Cathcart talking to you about the physical effects of chemotherapy.